Hi guys and welcome to this Flight Simulator 2024 video. We are less than two months away from the game being released uh, so I thought I'd show you how to get this game for much cheaper than it already is. Now if you are a member of Xbox Game Pass, which I am, you will be getting the standard edition for free on day one which is November 19th. However, there are three other versions uh, available on this game which is uh, Premium Deluxe, uh, deluxe aviator edition and they all cost quite a bit so if we start with the deluxe edition uh, that starts at 99.99 premium deluxe edition is 129.99 and the aviator edition is 199.99 now that is quite a bit and i'll show you the differences in um, each version right now so the standard edition you get uh, 70 um, aircrafts with uh, a few new additions as you can see on the screen here you will have the Airbus A310-300 which we already have you've got the A320neo and then the new aircraft will be the A321LR uh, which will be developed by Inibuilds you've got the A330 uh, which will be developed by Inibuilds and you've also got the Beluga XL which is quite nice uh, you've got the A400M you've got an Airbus uh, helicopter you've got an Airbus Indust Industry Skyship which um, I probably won't be using. There is a uh, Boeing 737 MAX 8 which looks really good and that's being developed by Asobo as well as a Boeing 747-8i. Um, in terms of the aircrafts in the standard edition for me I'm more interested in the jets. Uh, they will have some hot air balloons as well so that would be quite fun to fly. But for me it's the A321LR, the A330's Beluga and the 747s and this is all just uh the standard edition of the aircraft i mean of the game whereas the deluxe edition which i'll show you right now uh there's an extra 10 aircrafts uh you've got the amphibian aerospace you've got a beachcraft cessna uh well different variations of the cessna and um a dornier sea star which i've not really heard of before i think it might be one of those unique aircrafts um yeah an extra 10 uh, aircrafts for that uh with an extra increase in 30 pounds obviously that is not worth it um you're essentially paying 30 quid for three 10 extra aircrafts which aren't that great um i'll show you what the premium deluxe uh, edition gets you which is an extra 15 and the aircrafts in that one are quite good so here are the uh, 15 aircrafts in the Premium Deluxe Edition. You've got the Airbus Helicopter, uh, a Beechcraft, you've got the Boeing Company 747 Global Super Tanker. You've also got the 747 Dreamlifter, uh, which is the equivalent of the Beluga, but for Airbus. You've got the 78710 uh, Dreamliner, you've got the C-17 Globemaster, you've got a Chinook. Um, yeah, you can see all the aircrafts on, on display here. Um, Again, this is an extra increase of 30 quid. So you've got 69.99 for the standard, uh, you've got 99.99 for the deluxe, and then you've got uh, 129.99 for the premium deluxe. Now, um, I'm not going to be paying that full price, um, and I don't want you guys to be paying that full price for that as well. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to show you how to get it for cheaper. Um, I'm looking at around 30, 40 quid, maybe, uh, depending on currency conversion but if you've seen my other videos where i've showed you how to get um the boeing triple seven for cheap as well as xbox game pass for cheap then yeah you're gonna love this video before i get to that um there are two more additions that i haven't uh, spoken about uh that's the aviator edition and the collector's edition now the aviator edition the only difference is you get 30 payware microsoft uh developed aircrafts now those are the um aircrafts that they've released uh, throughout flight simulator 2020 those special ones that to be fair i don't really use i've never bought any of those and the collector's edition which you can see on the screen right now you get everything in the aviator edition plus a antonov uh, 225 model you get a flight bag with six patch sets uh, for bag applications. You get a bag, a collectible retail box, a letter, pins, uh, as well as some other special goodies. Uh, you've got a keychain, a letter, and some collectible thingy. Uh, the price for that is uh, so the Aviator edition is one hundred and ninety nine ninety nine, 
and the collector's edition which you can only um, order through Aerosource website is 235 euros uh, I don't know the um, UK price let me just double check that but yeah 235 euros for basically all of that um, it's very expensive I, I want I want to buy this but yeah I'm not spending that much on that um, I'll probably just see if I can find it on eBay but now let's go into the uh, the main event what you're all here for so what you what you want to do is basically go to the Xbox Turkish account the Microsoft Store account you don't need a VPN for this and as you can see on the screen uh, you've got uh, all four editions uh, up to Aviator and here are the prices so for uh, the premium deluxe edition you are looking at 3799.99 Turkish Liras now if you do that um, if you convert that into pounds it is around 83 pounds 81 pence now considering the uh, the UK price was 129.99 you're looking at a very good um, savings right there so that's what I'm gonna do I did this for flight simulator 2020 with the premium deluxe edition and I paid around 25 pounds back then but I ordered it through the Icelandic store because uh, there was some sort of sale going on so yeah that's how I did my one um, I'll run through the prices for the other editions right now so for the deluxe edition you are looking at 2899 Turkish Lira which is uh, around 64 pounds considering the normal one is 99.99 UK uh, this is a great price in, in my opinion I've already shown you the premium deluxe so this is the aviator edition uh, 127 pounds 94 which is around 5799 Turkish Lira so now these are the, the prices for this are really good standard you're looking at 60 uh, deluxe no deluxe you're looking around 60 quid a um, premium deluxe around 84 and then you've got the aviator edition which is uh, around 124 pounds uh, which is saving you quite a bit of money and honestly this is the way to go uh, just to stress you don't need to do uh, use VPN for this um, I've purchased it myself and it's worked uh, perfectly fine um, the way it, just buying it from the website so yeah I mean it's pretty simple to do saves you a lot of money and I'd highly recommend it as always uh, thanks for watching this video uh, leave a like Press that subscribe button and thanks for watching.